Good morning, fans of Privateer FX. Coming at you on Ascension Day. Buckle your seatbelts up if you're a Christian. Jesus is heading on a flight to heaven today, historically. Uh, for the rest of us, it should be a quiet day in the market. Most of uh, Europe has taken the bridge, or as they say, le pont, in uh, French. So Thursday, Friday, everyone takes off. So it should be quiet. So we'll make this quick, um, interesting little turn last night. And we'll see if we get some follow through today in the New York session. And uh, tomorrow, again, we'll be training mainly the New York session. Um, let's take a look at a couple of these charts. Aussie printed 16 last night on a bit of a stretchy. Um, now has turned. Aussie yen, same type of deal. Um, printed up to 04. Now has turned. Yes, went right to that famous little high. Now we have a very interesting double top up there. Bearish engulfed in Asia on the four hourly. In the middle of nowhere now, 45 the low. We're right here at 56. This could go anywhere, but it has turned. It's a tradable short if, you, if you're short in the tactical book. Um, It'll just be very interesting up here, right? The space between the 61.8, which is 29.66, and the 200-day moving average, which is 3,000. It's kind of no man's land. See how this gets digested. Um, you really can't get super bearish. Or you really can't get too bearish until we get down through 29.08. So... You can tactically play short, which is what we suggest. Um, but you can't put uh, push the chips in until we get back below 29.08. Dollars are. Let's take a quick look at that one. That sucker surprised a lot of people yesterday. Big, big move. Boom. 40 handles. Down to 91, 92 area inching back higher today. This is just a risk on proxy. That line worked pretty well, I gotta say. 18.17. Um, we did not trade it, but looked like it worked pretty well. Um, I'd buy this. Even though the chart's pretty bearish, I would buy this. Uh, I think risk has turned. Um, I think this is just stopping out all of the natural logical positions and uh, this will turn today. So we're buyers of dollars are today. We're going to sort of spread this sort of 95, 85, um, 75, three buys um, to tactically get long dollars are for a move back up to 1950. Kiwi. Big three day stretch from fifty nine thirty five to basically sixty one sixty. Gotta watch these highs now. Um, if this thing flips and goes insane risk on, Kiwi's your horse. Sixty one seventy five up here. And even more importantly, Kiwi Yen, 6620. 19 the high last night, or 18 the high last night. Sort of a classic chart, that one. If we're risk on and this all turns, Kiwi's your horse. Gold, not doing much, fucking around here. After this bearish engulf, 
traded up to 55, down to 39. Um, will we get back below 27? I don't think so, but maybe. Um, our next trade will be buying through 1776 U.S. Independence. Easy to remember that level, right? Crude bid as all shit. It's, uh, how did I not make money on this recently? It's, I guess it's because I suck at crude. But um, shit's bid. Look at that. That's good for Euro Norway. Bears, of course. Um, and Dollar Cad is just being a dick, really. Um, 69 the low yesterday. Good, good, heavy, heavy buying between 60 and 80 yesterday. Um, and if you recall, on Tuesday, also heavy buying at 05 in the figure before we broke. Uh, so... I don't know. Seems to be some big money buying uh, dollar cat on the 138 handle. Um, this is basically the same thing as your Kiwi chart. So 138.50. So if there's a vaccine or some hysterically great good news um, for risk, Kiwi, mine, dollar cat, yours. Might as well visualize that now, because when it happens, it's going to be quite hectic. So the more you think about it, the more you're ready to do it. It's complicated, right? Because right now we're short risk. But if things go risk on, buy the bird and buy the loony. <laughs> anyway, talking a lot, not saying too much today. Um, you can trade this from the risk off if you like, or you can just take the morning off. Um, and we got to see what New York's going to do with the ES chart. Currencies this morning are going to be dead, so there'll be really no tactical trading. Uh, just some light stuff. We're trying to buy some dollars. R uh, basically is is what's on the menu today. So keep an eye on uh, these levels, these dollar CAD levels, these Kiwi levels, and. We wait for New York. Good luck out there, people. Talk to you tomorrow.